Alright guys, welcome back to another episode of Going Medieval. So today uh, we are going to work on that building a little bit more and we're going to see if we can't get this finished for the most part. I have, um, what do you call it, a ladder going up here just so we can get this part all finished uh, above the window here. But <laughs> they started over on this side for some reason. I'm not sure why, but I think it's just closer to the ladder. Okay, so we got farming tutorial. Yes, I know how to do that. Uh, friendly visit, chaplain. Okay, so we got a chaplain again. <laughs> Alrighty then. Um, we already did that, but all right. I'm pretty sure we did an event last episode that uh, we hosted an event, but thankfully it doesn't require too much. Um, resources just wine so wine and well preferably bread but i don't think that um we have any bread unfortunately uh yeah uh, we're cooking that barley yeah we're not cooking barley um Just trying to think how I can make this more efficient <clears throat> because I know that actually is this shelf on high no it's on low so let's go ahead and switch that to high because they're not gonna get the um, herbs here if we don't do that um okay so what do we got here rough wine so yeah we could do it we could do that I guess I think we have more resources in the um, thing. We also had to pay ransom last episode as well. So we got some of that. Rough wine. Do we have any fine wine? Aged fine wine. We have 10. That should be enough for the event. Beer pile. Yeah, so... I think after we build this building, what I'm going to do is I'm going to focus on the... Um, what do you call it? The uh, storage room? A little bit more. I know that we have a lot of crops and stuff down here, but we haven't finished the uh, upgrading it and everything. Uh, as you can see, we got to this point, and then I decided to focus on getting the kitchen and stuff done, I think. so. Though, pretty soon, when we get our person back from our delivery... Um, oh yeah, we got friendly with that faction as well so we can start doing the um other faction b behind
Alright, so I'm going to host that event. I just remembered that we were going to do that, so we'll do that right now. And uh, we did get that bricks. I don't think we have enough to finish all the um, projects. I'm not sure if we do or not. Let's see here. We have 103. Yeah, I don't think we're going to have enough uh, to do that with the uh, thing. But I, I did decide to kind of wrap the fence around here. We're going to utilize, like, this is an odd shape um, place for the, uh, what do you call it, the fence, like this the green area to align with the uh, thing. Now, I could tear down all this and remove the, relocate the path and everything like that. But then that would mean that this area is not going to be... Um, it's going to be too big for that. So what I decided to do was because it's right on the front here uh, for the water. Uh, what I'm going to do is just going to have kind of like a green space here. I'm not sure what I'm going to put here just yet. I was thinking maybe we could uh, do something a little bit different. Maybe run crops or something. But I need to keep an eye on the, the shadows and see how that's all going to turn out. Um, because I don't want it to uh, not get enough sunlight and with the roof and stuff not on yet I'm going to just kind of keep an eye on the shadow line and right now it just looks like it's only like about three blocks out so it might be about four but we might be able to fit a small garden right along here along the edge line and we'll see it, how that turns out when we actually have the roof and stuff on but that's what I'm aiming for at least so we'll see how it turns out from there but um we have to get the roof on before I know for sure what it's going to look like. But I think we might be able to fit a small garden in. And uh, not not anything like crop-wise. We might plant some herbs here. And we'll see if we can't plant the herbs. And even if, if we do the herbs, then what we can do is we can turn this into the berries, I think. Alright, so we got that. Let's just uh, take a look at what... The rep we we have with them. Oh, where are they? They're where are they going? There they are. Okay, we're at sixty eight percent aligned with them. That's not too bad. We're still neutral. Um, where is she wolf? She wolf is Ben she wolf way over there. So though we don't trade with them, we're actually getting pretty good rep with them because we're um doing the uh like events and stuff so that's good all right anyhow uh that's the plan at least it was the garden i'm still gonna
All right, so we're just slowly moving stuff into the new, what do you call it, the um, textile uh, building. So I got pretty much everything moved in from the old place. Uh, we have a little bit more room actually. Uh, it should be a pretty good quality uh, room when it's done. Uh, I still have to get, uh, let's see, the candles built and there's like one banner and that workstation here. I think that's about it. And those three shelves back here will need to be um, configured as well. So we're going to disable that uh, for the time being. And hopefully, you know, I'm just going to select all these and then tell them to enable these and then we'll clear them just to make sure that we don't get um, anything transferred here. And I got the um, tools on the other side here where the chests are, so that's kind of like required to make it a better workstation area. And as far as lighting, I'm not sure how the lighting's going to do for all this. Like it's showing light that's coming in on the part right where the banners are, but it shouldn't be because it's a fully encased room, so I'm not sure what's going on with that. But um, yeah, I'm just basically waiting for people to bring stuff over and hopefully we'll be able to do that but let's see here she's bringing a chest over we only have a uh, like four more chests that would need to be placed in here so that's not too bad it's from the old building that was over here and then we have the uh cloth here that we'll be moving over and i figure what we'll do is we'll go with uh deer hide for one of these container or shelves and probably wool cloth for the other one. This is linen. So that will give us um, a little bit. And then we'll probably choose a couple other animals for fur. Probably like cattle or something for uh, the other three here. I'm not sure what I want for the other ones. Maybe we'll go with donkey skin. I'm not sure just yet. Definitely deer. Chickens don't really produce anything. I think goats do, and so do you sheep, as well as wool. Cattle's kind of red, so we'll go with that. Maybe we'll go with like donkey, yeah. I know we don't produce a lot of it, but it could be kind of nice to have. We'll see. All right, so chests are just about moved in, and that means they should be moving just the final stuff over. Okay, perfect. All right, so hopefully they'll start working on the, um... Alright guys, so I got the textile place all set up. So we got this all ready to go. We got the um, 
donkey leather here. We got cattle leather there. We got some herbs because we need herbs for making tapestry. So that's basically what I've been working on there. Uh, tapestry will be for export, I think. And then we got linen cloth and wool, uh, which is used over on this station for... Um, Wool's used for the uh, winter clothes, and then linens for the hats and summer clothes. We also have deconstruction over here for the linen and stuff. That's at highest priority for deconstruction, so they'll try to keep it at highest quality as uh, possible. Uh, for that, I have it set to uh, destroy anything that is damaged 90% or so. I think it's like 95% and the other one is anything good or flimsy to good. So anything above that will basically be able to uh, be used and stuff. So um, outside of that, we have the containers over here. I do want to quickly set up this to 95. Just uh, do that quickly. Reason being is then all the stuff that is required for 95 is going to be over here for deconstruction and then it's right direct like right across the station right so let's see if we can get this set up ah i hate how it's like that one percent kind of thing okay let's try this again go 96 hopefully that will bring it to 95 yep there we go all right anyhow uh that's basically what we did today uh we got a little bit of the other room built and stuff i got uh ran out of uh limestone bricks but we'll be i sent somebody out to a faction that hasn't visited us for a while so i'm sending out food there they should have just left i think yeah they're on their way already so that will be good but outside of that, if you are new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe, comment down below, rate the video, and I will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Peace out.